you live in the fetish world, Ollie, yes. don't you? Yes, I'm a huge part of the fetish world. I am Mr. Size 15 feet of the fetish world. And so, if, I, if someone doesn't know what size 15 feet of the fetish world is, could you just describe to us vanilla people over here? Uh, it is someone who gets paid to use their massive feet to do different sort of things. It could be normal day-to-day tasks, or it could be like today, for instance, it was someone's birthday, so they paid me to squash their birthday cake. To what, sorry? Squash their birthday cake. Squash their birthday cake. Excellent. So did they say, is this meant to be funny? No, this is, this is true, Chris. This is true. <laughs> this is a true story. This is Chris life. one of your, that's it, that's your life. Um, so, uh, so you've got massive feet and is it usually men that pay you or women? Yes. It's normally men. It's more than normal blokes. Is it straight blokes or gay guys or mix? I uh, gay guys. Okay. okay. So you're okay. Okay. So then, um, so like if I, if I have a birthday for a friend and I want to pay them, obviously you give me mates rates discount, but how oh. much does that cost? Well, for me to squash the cake. So With for me feet. to go out and buy the cake on the sofa. So today was a hundred for the birthday cake. For me to go out for I squash it, so and so forth. Ten minute video, so and so forth. That's the basic sort of thing. But sometimes oh, it's see. normally like 40 quid. If I don't have to go out the house to buy the cake, then that's that's fine. But how did, you how know all about you... customs? Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, I, I mean, I was the world's worst sugar baby. So like, um, you know, I props up to you for managing to make this. So how did you discover that you could make money out of making videos for, for people with your feet? It isn't always just my feet. So I've been paid to do really weird stuff. I was paid before to queue up in the post office. And literally my friend had to film me in the queue. And this person got off on someone doing really mundane, boring tasks, wasting their time. <laughs> That's brilliant. So someone's gone, I want to pay you good money yeah. to queue in the post office yeah. and, and, and I want you to film it. And, and that, I mean, someone's hearting that. They're like, I'm into that. that That's is him. Completely... That's him. No, I'm joking. Who it is it? <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Ollie, I'd absolutely fucking love this if that was true. So, um, <laughs> so, Okay, foot guide zero zero. Yeah, I know you're getting a few of those people now. <laughs> I lo- mate, I love it. I love it. So, Bobby on Facebook asks, "What happens to the cake? It, do you then eat it, or do you send them the cake, or does the uh, cake go in the bin?" I don't eat the cake, right? So, if they're booking for real time meat, sometimes I do meet these people as well. Then they can eat the cake if they wish. But this time, no, it was a very awkward trip to the bathroom involving me basically sliding on lamino flooring with chocolate cake all the way down and hand on heart, truthfully, my neighbour knocked my door and my bathroom is like, so my front room's here, my bathroom's past the hallway. So when I opened the door, I turned around and there was just like these long brown streaks going down my hallway. So she probably just thought I was just uh, shitting, as you do. <laughs> like you've got a problem, you've got a problem. Yeah. That's, that's mental. That's, I'm, I'm just like, has anyone got any questions? Um, like, was anyone any questions for Ollie for this? Like, what is it? What is that? What what questions normally people ask you when you tell them? This? Oh God, what's the weirdest thing you've ever done? Have you met any weirdos? How much do you charge? What's the most popular? Like, what is the most popular? Something called macrophilia. Now, macrophilia uh, <laughs> is the fetish or fantasy of having a relation with a giant person. So these people asked me to pretend that I'm 200 foot tall and I have like a small little railway with loads of little railway people that I squash under my feet and stuff like that. Think of The Borrowers, the movie, that's like porn to them. So in your house you've got a tiny tiny railway? Yeah, yes, I've got little tiny railways, I've got little cardboard houses that I crush under my feet, I've got loads of little... Can we have a look? Can we have a look? Come on. I can't so, believe I've known you for so long, Ollie, and I've never oh, done this Oh, come with you. on. Like, seriously. So, look, these are all the, like, the tiny little cardboard houses that I then come along and crush. Like, there's, there's loads of them. There's a the big black screen there. Um, I crush a lot of toy cars. A lot so of what do you, 
so hang on so what do you do so where do you put the camera are you standing up right and so like, sometimes put... the camera is point of view so the camera is their view and other times it's like on the floor by the way you all owe me 120 quid for this <laughs> it's like you know like uh, yes, mate. It's i'm so gonna cry where you are here we go, here we go. It's so dark sorry Sorry. Right, go it's on. like, here we go. Oh, so I'm so going to crush your thing. I'm going to crush your house. Yeah. Oh, go Be on. Be five, four, yeah. thumb. <laughs> Boom. 120 quid. Thank you. But no, look, I've got like little trees and little benches. Like, my life's mad. My life's mad. <laughs> And so, what, like, what, what are the, so what are the people doing while you're giving them a video? And they just like, oh, oh. I don't know. I've never really. <laughs> there we go. I'm back. So, um, oh my god, I've got so many. Um, Michael on YouTube asks Ollie, do you know what snowballing means? My mate's brother told me what it means. Sure, Michael. Isn't that when? Hang on. Yeah, yeah. Hang on. I, I don't think his brother's friends told him or whoever that is. I think he knows exactly what snowballing is, and it's a no from me. What? What is it? I, I, I believe it's when you in each other's mouths and then you pass it, don't you? So it continuously gets bigger. <laughs> oh right. So, hang on, hang on. So, whoa, 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 whoa. Let's not. This is not a place for innuendo. So you wank off in each other's mouths and then you spit it back into each other's mouths? I, I believe so. Or you spit it into the next person's mouth so it continuously gets bigger. Do you know what I see? So it's why it's snowballing down the hill. I don't know how I know no. that. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm confused. So there's two, there's two blokes or there's more mm -hmm. than two? It might and be more one... than two. So guy A wanks into guy B's guy mouth. Guy B's mouth. Then guy B will probably uh, into guy A. Guy A will spit that into guy B's mouth with his stuff I... still in there. And then if there's more people, it keeps going. It's like, it's like really shitty chain map. <laughs> I don't know. It's kind of hot in a seedy way. Like, it's kind of like, oh, what's yeah. the greatest thing we could do? It, Just get all our spunk. It's something I hope people aren't doing in this current times with the virus on the sofa going around doing that but yes i I'm, i do know what snowballing is and no 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 i don't do it um, so do like do you show, do you do sexual stuff do you do wanky wanky stuff or anything like that not really i have been made to so like the point of view camera with the macrophilia they like to get slapped with a ginormous pin like wink wink nudge nudge all you have to do is zoom in with the camera and then, like, so do you see what I mean? It's point of view, they're getting beaten up by a penis. I know it sounds quite weird. Um, so I do uh, stuff whoa, like whoa, that. Whoa, 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 whoa. So you're, <laughs> you're, you're standing, you're like this, and you're like, are you like, are you like knelt down, and then you're just whapping your dick on the on the lens? Yeah, so it's like, way boom, way boom, <laughs> way boom. <laughs> and that's how you get blocked from Instagram. <laughs> no. Oh, I hope you don't. Don't, don't, don't. don't. <laughs> um, so, do you, I'm guessing your family, now you, you're on this Instagram live, I guess your family know about this. Oh, God, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm known as Footboy at Christmas. But Are it's you? funny, but, but my stuff's paid for all of their presents. And last year, the whole Christmas meal. So, let's be real. Oh, that, so, uh, that, I mean, you seem quite comfortable with it. Like, um... <laughs> Was there like, uh, was there any, any awkward sort of coming out foot stuff coming? Like, did you have any diff, uh, did you have any like awkward conversations? I had it where. <laughs> Tyson 17s goes, uh, I think he's one of yours. I've read he's got, it as well. <laughs> he's got giant feet we want to devour. Tyson yeah. 17, what do you love about Ollie's massive giant feet? I'm interested. Oh, the work name's Ryan. Just saying. But, but, but no, 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 don't worry, don't worry. I switch it round. So I actually go as Ryan Oliver Landra, not my real surname, but that, that's my work name. So don't worry, you haven't just given away my location. Is. Yeah, don't worry. But um, no, no, my family were all actually quite supportive. Like I said to them, this is how it's going to everyone. Okay, it's very weird what they might be into, like they want you to do in a post office and so forth. But they could be into a lot worse like illegal stuff so at least them coming to me 
both parties are willing, both parties are happy, I'm offering a service, they're paying for it, we're all winners. So you know, my family you know you won't could, be bothered. You're, you're never going to get a normal office job, are you? No, I, could, I couldn't be that boring. I worked six years in the theatre and I caused more drama off the stage than on the stage. <laughs> um, so have you got an OnlyFans? I've got a Just For Fans. They pay out more. Oh, really? Yeah, but I am also launching an OnlyFans for my macrophilia content. We love Ryan oh. being a big alpha dom. I'd love to be his friend. Oh. I'm so this sorry is... about these people growing up here. No, I lo- no, I love it. So as you know, I've dipped <laughs> into the world of fetish uh, fetish dating apps. Obviously, I'm a connoisseur. I'm not. I'm the most vanilla bitch on there. I'm so basic. Um, no. So, <laughs> yeah. Really? <laughs> <laughs> that that does surprise me from you, Ellen. You know, two free shows. All about yeah. sex and so forth. No, no, I am. I'm, I'm really quite, I'm really vanilla. I'm realising how vanilla I am. But what I love about um, interacting with people on the fetish apps is that I'm having more emotionally honest conversations with men before I even meet them than I would in a month of fucking a guy from Tinder. Yeah. Yeah, it's I like, get you. It's, it's amazing. Like, I really recommend it. Like, um, in, you're not going out on a date with a guy from Tinder who's then, like, two months down the line after you've done all these dates. Like, I want to do four lines of cocaine off your beads and you wear a strap on and I wear your knickers as you call me Laura. That sort of thing. See, with the no, fetish sites, they will be like, just so you want to know, I do want to do the cocaine off your beads and you wear a strap on and you call me Laura. They will be honest with you. And that's what I love about this. Kinky yeah, me world. too. <laughs> yeah, me too. But I'm, I'm. I think it's more like emotional, like honesty, like, um, like, like you'll have a chat, and be like, "What are you looking for? Oh, I'm looking for this. Are you open to this? No, not really. Okay, bye." Whereas yeah. a Tinder guy will just be like, "There's a vagina. I need to fuck it," and we'll just <laughs> and we'll say anything, and we'll, and then they're they're very unclear about their actions. They'll kind of like sneaky. Be co- hey, they're sneaky. <laughs> sneaky yeah they are a little bit sneaky and they're not very honest and then you can't when you ask you kind of go oh you know we've been sort of banging six weeks and uh you know you keep texting me during the day and you send me cat memes um yeah. do you know blah, 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 are we uh? <laughs> and then and then he and then he treats you like a fucking cunt and he goes to you and he's like oh you're disgusting you've got feelings ah! uh. um, and it's a bit like that so i'm all about it <laughs> ben is saying so true um bobby on facebook what a fool i've been breaking stuff for free for years um <laughs> aaron uh, who came on the other week said you literally couldn't pay me to queue at the post office um and miss <laughs> and and cat who's coming on later says this is this sounds like the perfect job for her um which yeah she's an actor yeah. and she's no tiny, cv so. needed <laughs> no cv needed so um i, I don't so um Basically, I got my wank tape from um, Owen Gray this week, yeah. today, um, and, I, and I'm scared of watching it, frankly. I watched the first three seconds, got very giggly, like, oh my God, I think, you know, it's just weird. I've never had, have you ever done personalised stuff like that, where you've said people's names or stuff like that? Yeah, 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 all the time, all the time. So quite often they'll want me to say their name, because their name's James, I like, hey, James, you've been strong. Da, 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 da. Like I've got even little effects when I shoot them with a the gun and they shrink and I have to use their name each time so they know it's for them but no yeah the name thing so come on well, tell I, us. I know, no I've, I've like watched three seconds I'm too scared to watch it <laughs> I'm like, honestly I felt like I feel like it was if I don't know if you ever fancy someone at high school like properly I fancy Christopher Bradley um he was two years older than me and um um, yeah, like I, I feel like Christopher Bradley's just told me that he's in love with me. That's essentially it. Oh. So I, I can't, I, I don't know how I'm going to deal with the remaining 12 and a half minutes of it, Oz, to be honest. Have you got oh, any tips? Like no. <laughs> I've never had that problem. I've never been on the that side of it. Um, no, I'm not too sure. <laughs> um, but maybe watch it without the sound. I don't know. Maybe try not to make eye contact when watching it. <laughs> And yeah, I don't know. Has anyone got any questions for Ollie? Um, feel free to put them in the comments. Um, You're going to get some so, really dodgy questions. <laughs> on no, 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 no. I love it, though. I abs- I'm a big fan. I'm a big fan of this. Everyone's just like, ooh, what's going on? Gift of Gabriel. Hello, Micromant. 
two. Love it. Micro, Patrick. micro man. That means macrophilia. I bet. Micro so, do you think so? Macro, yeah, maybe. Do you think there's porn? Is there microphilia porn? Macrophilia porn. Yeah. Is it? Know. Yeah, and it's a really niche market with such a high income. It's quite fun. Is it's it quite one niche? thing. That, yeah, it's it is quite niche, but it's growing. It's growing. So, um, Pornhub released this most set things on the sofa and on one of it it showed in the past three years that it jumped up to like 40th most you know, set category was saying so, so what, what, uh, what's it called uh, so macrophilia Mac you've gone a bit uh, funny on your camera by the way oh it's because i'm okay yeah. Macroph macrophilia is a fascination with with or sexual fantasy involving giants most commonly expressed as giant s's female giants it's typically a male fact, but i'm guessing that you know i'm um, six Tyson foot seven and i've got size 15 feet there's no special effects needed <laughs> oh ty sans asks what are your kinks ollie or is that is that is that is that um is brian's that kinks That's um money <laughs> Ryan, I feel so bad for, like, mixing up your names. No, don't worry. No, no, seriously, do not worry. I I'm quite open about my name, Ollie Ryan. I just use Ryan as a bit of an alter ego, you know, so someone to perform as, but no, everyone knows. <laughs> um, where do, so where do you get all your business? So, right, so when I was having a look at Owen Gray, so basically I was watching, uh, Owen Gray's like my favourite porn star, so I watch him on Pornhub, and third then I start... Star. Hey? Sorry, just third most search is Owen Gray. Is it? Star. Yeah, look on the male porn. I'm going to send it to you. It's Pornhub's most searched male porn stars. I think he's so much better. Why do you think? Right, because I know, I know why I, I know why I find him amazing. Do you do you watch him or not? I've I've got a few friends who have mentioned him and Danny D, but I Owen Gray comes up a lot more, and I think I know why. He's why? does he offers a lot more of the bondage, rough sex, sort of, <laughs> sort of stuff, you know what I mean? <laughs> Sorry, what was that? What the fuck does that, that mean? That was, I don't know, someone getting fingered and squirting, you know, that sort of, Ooh. it's like Travel the Fountain, that sort of porn. I think he features in those sort of porn videos quite a bit as well, doesn't he? And well, maybe uh, because, well, well, go on. Sorry. Maybe because no, he does a lot of videos now, so he's in his prime on the sofa, so I think he... In his videos, he does a lot of gangbangs and stuff like that. And it's not always solo. I don't know his only fan, so I'm only going on what I know and what I've seen. So I'm guessing so, I, it's more of the rough thing. No, so on his, on his, um, on his main pro Pornhub profile, he does like a lot of... He does a lot of girl and threesomes with two guys. So I, for me, I feel like he's quite female-focused. Mm -hmm. Like he takes out that big magic wand that like it's like the girls all look like they're having a lovely time. <laughs> yeah. And he has a threesome and there's like he has a threesome with his other mate is all who's all like tattooed. Who's that guy? Do you know that guy? I'm not too sure. I'm not oh, right. yeah, But, but they've kind does... of got the same sort of almost tattoos apart from the arm, the long arm. Yeah, they look they, they look they look they look similar vibes, right? And then mm -hmm. like and they honestly they look when they're when they're banging the girl, they honestly, it's like they'll keep one thing and then they'll automatically change and then they'll automatically change. And it's like one will take the other side. and It's just almost like a dance. And the, like, they are so nice to the girl. Like, it's all about the girl. Thanks, Torbed. It's all about the girl. And there's like just the little sort of sweep of the hair and you're like, oh, he loves her. <laughs> no, no, he doesn't. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> He's making eye contact. <laughs> um, <laughs> But like it's really caring. It's and, and and I sometimes feel like when I'm watching straight porn, it, it's just like men using the women as a fleshlight. It just feels oh a bit yeah, like... yeah, like all right, my step sister, that sort of all step daughter, <laughs> yeah. all of that stuff. I'm like yeah, I know, I, I get what you mean. I find that a bit odd, but the gay community, you know, their porn searches. I'm so sending you this most searched porn thing. You're gonna love it. <laughs> brilliant billy billy is overjoyed with the six six foot seven size 15 feet absolutely amazing hello uh, yeah you got thanks billy i accept yeah. cash app paypal uh amazon uk vouchers <laughs> <laughs> i love it send them to I elena 
<laughs> no, no, send, send them to Ryan. Um, yeah, yeah. So that, I think that's why women like him. Um, and um, I've realised that now he's sending me a solo video. I don't get that connection with the other women in the, you know, like, it's pointless. Me, I'm, I'm a bit nervous about watching it, basically. I think, I think that's the point I'm trying to say. I'm a bit nervous. And, it, oh. and, and, and because I've shared it with everyone, because it's been crowdfunded by everyone, I'm slightly like... I know. Uh, just, just to say, amazing. First ever crowdfunded custom porn video. <laughs> 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 yeah so like now i just feel like if i report back on it then everyone's gonna know that i wank <laughs> <laughs> you've watched it four times over really haven't you that's why you're like i've only watched three seconds <laughs> well, i've done no work it's hard today um yeah so i feel kind of like i feel a bit stressed out i don't know how i'm gonna tackle it but i think it's gonna be fine um is it right so how do you get all your, so yeah so what i was going to say was what owen does is he he chucks loads of free shit on pornhub and then he has the own the branded only fan stuff um oh you've been asked to show your feet but i'm pretty sure no. we have to pay you for that no because like, if i start doing that they they all come they they, they they they'll all be well literally come and coming <laughs> but <laughs> You're gone. Where do oh, I yeah, promote? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, so how do you, do you? So, what he does is he he seeds his OnlyFans content on Pornhub, and then it makes you sign up to his OnlyFans. And I did that, and I was like, oh, I'll give you ten quid. Oh, <laughs> um, and then on his OnlyFans, he gives like one minute previews of videos. No. Like, yes, pay mate, for more. Fucking, yeah, he's oh, so that is, he's like, that's naughty, it's though. Snide. It's snide. That he's is got, snide. Like, He's got yeah. my fucking 10 quid a month from OnlyFans. And then he's like, if you want to see the full one, um, I'll put it in your inbox. You can buy it for seven bucks. Yeah. And every day he's putting a full length one. And I tell you what, the women on there, they there's just the women are just horny, middle-aged women. <laughs> um, and they're just like, honestly, I've never seen women act so, like, so much like a horny boy. <laughs> it's... It's all, I almost feel like feminism is there. You know, when you start to see, for example, when women get to start, when women start to make average Hollywood movies, you know that there's true equality. Like yeah. when, you know what I mean? When we have the freedom to make averageness and mediocrity. And, yeah. and I feel like that it, once we start to see like women uh, being quite obnoxious and like, oh God, oh, my pussy's so wet in the comments. <laughs> I feel like we're one step closer to feminism. Oh. <laughs> how, how do you advertise? How do you get all your clients? So my main thing is Twitter. Instagram is, no offence to Instagram, but they're a bit mm, with their terms and conditions. But Twitter basically like, what you want, say what you want. And I take advantage of Twitter. Twitter. Twitter's a big, big way. And also, I also post on a website called Sleepy Boy. What is for escorts and for domination and for other things like that? But a lot of them get pulled in from my Instagram. I post links and stuff to my Twitter. But yeah, my just for fans is my main income and also the cash slate. So if I do this, I'm also a cash man. I said, hang on, whoa, whoa, whoa! You're a cash slave. So people? No, 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 no! I'm a cash master. What's that? Right, so. A cash master is the opposite to a pay pig. Right? Are we whispering? <laughs> right, so, so a pay pig will pay a cash master. We, we don't pay cash master. Okay. It's, it's, it's the world of financial domination. I'd like to get into that. How do I do that? You would be amazing. Oh, my God, it's so much fun. Literally, go onto Twitter and literally search the word FINDOM, F-I-N-D-O-M. And Got you it. will see hundreds and hundreds, thousands, thousands of people doing it. There's some fake people doing it. There's some real people. Sounds so cool. You'll notice their pictures a lot of mostly feet as well. Feet sell it. So on so You degrade people via the tweet. So you say you're worthless. So so cool. A lot of them have crap on and stuff like that. You know, it isn't, nothing overly sexual is ever shown. And you get a lot of pay to come forward. The, the whole cash daddy thing that doesn't really exist as well anymore. It's all about pay pigs and pay cash. pigs. 
so what would I need to do? Like, I, cause I don't have any work coming in. So can, can I get a pay pig? Yes. Just one word of advice to everyone thinking about doing it. Never, ever, ever give out your PayPal email because oh, PayPal really? don't allow sexual favours and they class FinDom, financial domination, domination being sexual. So they don't class it. But Cash App, wink, wink, allow it. And Cash, Cash App is, is yeah, and that's the nominist on so forth. You would be able to join that. You'd receive money just like Okay, so what the fuck? How do, like because we we've got we we get, oh god, this is such a good chat. <laughs> Pat, I hope you can hang on. This is you I'd literally like just search the usernames and bring them in. So mm -hmm. your username can be anything. Mine is at UK Bigfoot Master. Yeah, and people literally put that in, and they can send money straight to it, and they don't even need to use their real name. And on their bank statement, it comes up as a cash out. So there's nothing. To say. All right, so I'm on Twitter now. Mm -hmm. So what? So what the fuck do I do? So I'm on Twitter now. What do I do? So I search in Twitter. Findom, F I N D O M. Just search that, and you'll see loads. Loads. Oh my god. Okay, Findom. I get paid tomorrow, Friday. Looking for cash drains. Oh, that sounds like me. By beautiful hot girls. I'm a woman, but I'll take the I'll take the You've sexism. Got to be careful. There are a lot of fakes on that scene. There, oh, there right, are fakes, and you will work out. But if you go and look at the females on the sofa, then you, you'll see that there are um, very good people there. I'm one of them. But yeah, yeah. it's literally. So okay, so my, my starter is to get a cash app application, cash app username. And then, this isn't really, is this a really viable way of getting money, Ollie, uh, Ryan? If the government are listening, turn away now, especially the tax man. But today I received an, I can tell you, hang on, two seconds, two seconds, um, two seconds. Oh my God, this is so good. Two seconds, just wait, two seconds. Yeah, absolutely, take your time. Da -da -da. So, Today, payment. Oh, there you are. Hello. Um, Hiya. By the way, by the way, thank you, Michael, for the PayPal donation of ten pounds. Thank you ooh. so much. Um, yeah. So today, I have received eighty pounds from Scott, one hundred and twenty pounds from Scott, sixty pounds from Scott, and then there's been small payments like thirteen fifty. Um, there's this one guy who likes me to just talk basically. Bollocks. To do what? To talk bollocks. Basically, to like yeah, yeah, wow, literally just a load of bollocks. Tell him about my day, so on and so forth. I don't know if we can see this, but he's already sent quite a lot of money over today and he gets sod all in return. I don't know, this is quite a bad deal. But yeah, it's very viable. Once it gets going, once you get past a couple of hundred followers, it gets really viable. Hang on, where do, I, do I, where do I get my followers on? Do I have to do it on Twitter? Twitter, yeah, keep using the hashtag. Go and look at other profiles and see the people they're tagging in. There's certain people who make the profiles just to retweet. So so oh there's retweet God. profiles. Um, Ty San says, the, compete, the scene is competitive, so most masters or doms don't laugh, but pay your taxes. Ah, my tax man, of course I have. The checks in the pay. <laughs> I, I always pay my taxes. Yeah, um, yeah no, no, yeah. I, I have paid my taxes, but yeah, <laughs> it that's, is that's, very good. That's very, that's so interesting. That is so interesting. Does anybody have oh. any questions for Ryan? So today I made someone wank off with a squid. Yeah. No. Yeah. That Why? Was it was. It. He went to Waitrose and bought it from the food counter. Like he's into humiliation and stuff like that. So there'll be so one for number. Like... How do you even? How do you even <laughs> think of that? You're like, right? What? Like you say, Barry, I have quite a lot go. of time and psychiatrist. Barry. He loves me. <laughs> Barry. Oh, so did he come up with the idea of wanking with a squid? No, you... no, no. I come up with that. <laughs> Mate, that's amazing. You're yeah. really wasted. Yeah, there's been other ones when they've um. 
Yeah, but there, there's, there's a lot when I can force the gay man to watch two girls, one cup, and he has to come at least three times before he can <laughs> stop watching it. Yeah, I've had someone doing naked star jokes while wanking listening to Aqua, Barbie Girl, on repeat, <laughs> and he had to come at least four times. Like, I, I'm, I'm evil. I'm evil. But I love it. <laughs> Honestly, like you are a mad control freak. I absolutely, I absolutely love it. So hang on, hang on. Could you, could you, <laughs> you, give me, you give me, you give me money on Patreon. So, um, uh, by the way, if you do want to help support the stream, please do uh, go to my patreon.com forward slash Alan the Conway. Um, does that mean you're, um, you're, I'm your I know what you're going to ask. Yeah. What? It'd be someone who's, and I'll be like, okay, Eleanor. <laughs> No, is that what you mean? Are you my pay pig? <laughs> no, I am not. <laughs> wow. No, I, I'm your comedy pig. No, I'm, I, oh, I'm something for you. I just love your work. <laughs> oh, Brian. Yes. Okay, Mike, chill out. We're getting, the, we're getting the fit girl on now, all right? Very funny fit girl. Fucking oh, hell. No, he's like, one. honestly, straight man. They're desperate. Oh. Desperate. Oh. Um, listen, no, no, we do have to, we do have to go because um, no, I feel, I feel bad. I've kept Katrina waiting for so long. Sorry, would, I'm sorry. No, would you, would you come on again, uh, Ryan? I would love to. I would absolutely love to. And if people want to find you and and um, find out more <laughs> about your work, um, they can find you where? By Twitter. Just look up UK Bigfoot Master. Or oh, there's a link just up there right now. You can just click that. <laughs> hey Ryan, I absolutely love you. Love you. Love, love you. You've got a little bit in there. <laughs> oh, I love you. Uh, Mike, Mike's excited. He's like, oh god, good, good. He's like, oh, he, I think, I think, I think we've stressed Mike out a little bit because he's, he can't. He's like, this is too much. This Mike's is too blown much. Been dumb, mate. <laughs> That's it. It's too much for my little heteronormative brain. Um, right. Look, we're going to get you on again. Thank you so much, Ryan. No problem. Um, I'm, um, thank you so much. Give the hearts to the old Rye boy. Ooh, oh my God. Amazing. Amazing. Like, um, I had a guest drop out. So like, um, Ryan was very much like, oh, can you help me? And he went, yeah, right. And, uh, yeah. Uh, Michael says, good luck snowballing. As I mentioned before, um, I do accept support for the stream because I can't do any live work. Uh, feel free to uh, drop me a donation via paypal.me forward slash Eleanor Conway. Um, or if you want to sign up to exclusive content, and I'm giving all the Patreons updates about um, the crowdfunded porn video. So you can unlock that via a Patreon subscription or a donation. So I'm fine, fine, put it out. All right, listen, what we're going to do is um, we're going to take a short break. I'm going to end the stream and then I'm going to come back. Come back? Or should we just bring her on? No, because the, the street Instagram will take, will switch the stream off. That's the problem. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go away. I'm going to come back. Uh, no, I'm not going to start selling feet pictures. My feet aren't great. I'm not gonna lie. Like pretty, I'm pretty good. Like boobs on point, legs on point, face pretty good, um, hands pretty good. Like a lot of, got a lot of features, but like that's not one of my. Like, and also like I've yeah, not one of my strong points. Yeah, thank you. Um, thanks. Um, yeah, thanks. I've gotten blonde. Um, big thanks again to Ryan. Have I got admin? Right. Are you guys gonna come back after the break? It's literally going to be in three minutes. Is that yet? Give me a give me a little heart if you're coming back. One person, come back after the match, love. Absolutely not, Michael. Um, okay, this this is a risk because there's thirteen of you. I genuinely hope that you come back. Right, fuck it, we're going to do it. Right, I'll see you in literally three minutes. Three minutes. 